I am going to explain about how to install Skype version 4.0 in CentOS 6.3 and Fedora 16 or 17. To install Skype 4.0, you need to install the dependency packages that we need for the Skype. The dependency packages can be installed using yum command. For executing the yum command, you must be a root user. yum install and the dependency packages you need to install libstd c plus plus dot i 686 lib x render dot i 686 font config dot i 686 pulse audio lips dot i 686 then qt iPhone X11 dot i 686 glib dot i 686 free type dot i686 also iPhone lib dot i686 lib X screen saver it is a CR and saver this should be caps dot I six eight six lib yet say dot six eight six then lib xv dot i six eight six then lib x dot i six eight six lib sm dot I six eight six these are all the dependency packages you need to install before installing the Skype.
give yes to download the dependency packages after downloading the packages it will install all the packages Now the packages are getting installed. Now all the dependency packages needed for Skype is installed. Now I am going to download the Skype package for installing. To download Skype package you can use the wget command wget and the link for the Skype. You have the link for the Skype package download. You can download the Skype package in the temporary folder. So I'm going to move change directory to temp. Now the Skype package is getting downloaded.
now his skype package is now downloaded Before extracting the Skype package file, you need to create a directory. And you need to create a directory called Skype under the directory opt. So I'm going to directory opt, and here you need to create the directory Skype. All the software packages which you are installing will be stored in this opt directory. So I am creating a directory called Skype in this to install the Skype application. Now the Skype directory is created under opt. Now you need to extract the tar file which is this Skype package from the temp directory for extracting the package you need to use star command star xvf on the Skype package name Skype static dot tar dot p is it too then you to mention the directory you need to extract to extract to the specific folder you can use hyphen c and then the path opt skype Now the files are extracted to the directory opt skype. After extracting the package, we need to create the soft links for the following files. First, ln s. user lib liptif dot so dot three and slash user lib liptif dot so dot four I press enter. Now the link is created for the file liptif.so.3. Now we have to create the symbolic links to the icons, language, and sound directory files. ln s. Opt Skype Skype static QT icons Sky Blue forty eight into forty eight dot PNG Plus user share pix maps and skype dot png now 
as this file is linked. Next file is how to link the same file to user share icons skype.png now this file is linked ln s op skype skype static qt sounds space slash user share sounds Now the symbolic link is created for the sound folder in Skype static QT to the directory and user share sounds. Now this directory is linked. Yellen hyphen S of Skype Skype static beauty language space class user share lang Now the symbolic link is created for the directory language. Now this last symbolic link is ln hyphen s of Skype Skype Qt so Skype static Qt. Skype dot desktop space slash user share applications then Skype dot desktop Now this offlink is created for the file skype.desktop. Now you need to create a launch file for the Skype application. For that you can use the touch command touch. Touch is used to create empty files. I'm using the touch command to create a file called Skype. User then Skype. I'm creating the file under the directory user bin. And set permissions for the file as seven double five. Now the 755 permission is set for the Skype file. Now open the Skype file which is under the directory user bin.
I've entered the following lines. Export Skype in caps Skype underscore home equal to double quotes and mention the Skype location which is in the opt directory. Skype and now the second line dollar symbol Skype home Skype underscore home slash Skype iPhone iPhone resources equal to dollar Skype home Skype, Skype underscore home space dollar and then asterisk the script file is used to execute the skype application now you need to save the, save the file now the file is saved There is little modification in the Skype file which is created now. User bin Skype. The Skype home location is op Skype. Then you, you need to add this directory Skype underscore static qt 4.0.0.8 0 .0 0 .0 and save the file now the installation process of the skype application is completed now to launch the skype application you just need to type Skype and give enter. Now the Skype application is launched. Now accept the license agreement. Now the Skype login page has been displayed. You can log in using your user ID and password. To check the Skype version, you can just click this icon and click about Skype. The Skype version is displayed, which is version 4.0. The same installation process can be used to install the Skype in Fedora 16 and 17. Thank you.